So patients with triple negative breast cancer that get treated with upfront chemotherapy, neoadjuvant chemotherapy, and do not achieve a path CR. So these are patients with residual disease, are the patients that will have the worst out, worst long-term outcomes. These are the patients that are going to recur quickly. And we have seen that time and time again. Most recently, we saw the data with key, from Keynote um, 522 were these patients that had residual disease did have um, worse EFS um, and we know that we need to do better we need to do more we need to figure out what better what other therapies we can add to improve outcomes in our patients that don't achieve don't achieve a path CR after being offered upfront um, chemo immunotherapy overall we are doing a terrible job at enrolling a diverse group of patients in breast cancer trials, and I would say in trials overall. As it relates to triple negative breast cancer, we know that black patients are more likely to develop triple negative breast cancer, yet they're still underrepresented in, clin in, in triple negative um, clinical trials. And I think we really have to be intentional about improving, improving enrollment of these patients that we know have the worst outcomes, we know have a overrepresentation, yet we're still not being able to dice out what what's driving some of these disparities, what's driving some of these worst outcomes. So I think really what we need to focus our efforts on are really trying to increase the enrollment of minority patients in our clinical in, in our clinical trials, specifically in our triple negative breast cancer trials.